Signs petitioning for patients versus signs petitioning for the right to choose. Racine Educators United and the Kenosha Education Association hosted a car caravan to express the importance of safely returning to schools. What would you say to parents that need their kids to go to school? I want to be clear that this isn't easy for educators either, um, but safety has to be the priority right now. And one of the hottest spots in, in Racine County for the, the spread of this virus. Racine County has had 19,000 positive COVID-19 cases, one of the highest rates in Wisconsin. Parents and staff here say one more person infected is one too many. Without a dramatic decrease in spread among our communities, returning to buildings before it is safe to do so will have fatal consequences. We're hopeful that vaccine distribution um, that's a step towards uh, making in-person learning uh, safer. Um, it's our hope that this ends sooner rather than later. And not even 10 minutes away, you have the other side of the story. Parents who are wanting to choose between rooms and Zooms. There are enough teachers who are wanting to come and and uh, teach our students in person. And parents here understand some teachers are at high risk, but say something needs to be done for students who are falling behind. My oldest has a, a really hard time paying attention to a computer. Um, he's not doing well in classes that he would normally do well in person. Students are speaking up too, saying remote learning just isn't the same. Not being able to like talk to your teachers in front of them, like if you need help. I miss. I miss my friends. Reporting in Racine, Diana Gutierrez, WISN 12 News.